Wen Sun Wu, Lao Fogge, and Wa Dai Shi Kei. This is my phone, and I can prove it in a couple ways. Up here, you can see my signal bars. I only got one because we're in this deep building. I'm going to open up this mail app now and actually click the. Oh my gosh, y'all are blowing up Twitter. I forgot that my demo account <laughs> is my Twitter handle. That was bad. Let me scroll down there. Cool. Here's my mail from Todd. Uh, and you can see I have a couple, couple documents here. What I'm going to do now is just open up some stuff to get ready to get productive. I'm going to open up Word with a double click because there's something in there I got to get to to do. Uh, and now, once that loads, remember, this is, look, this is the Word Universal uh, mobile app, Word Mobile. It's now scaling. This is the one that comes on the phone. It's scaling to look great on this screen. And look, all the functionality you expect is there. The welcome back message is there with one click. It takes me to where I, where I was in this document last, right? And I want to go back and open some other stuff. So how do I multitask? More PC-like experience. Look down here. My taskbar has my icons like you'd expect. The one that's running is highlighted like you would expect. With one click on Outlook, I can jump to that app and utilize it like you would expect on a PC, except this is actually a what? It's a phone. That's right. So I'll double click PowerPoint now to open that up. So I'm getting my stuff ready. Got to get this deck done because Todd's texting me in the middle of this. So it must be super important. Uh, and right now, I just want to pause. This is pretty cool. I showed you the taskbar, but look, I can bring up this task switcher and also bring that up. Who's used this task switcher on Windows 10 right now? It looks the same. Okay, now, I'm gonna pause before I do the actual cool office stuff that I'm gonna show you with the copy and pasting. Just to prove to you that my phone is, is, is powering this, uh, we're gonna cut now to a side-by-side. -side. I'm gonna show you, while I'm doing this, my phone is still a phone. You can see up here I'm connected to my monitor. But look, I can go back to my start menu, I can navigate things, I could open up and start texting people. My actual phone experience is not broken while I'm utilizing the desktop experience of Continuum. And neither is the one here. Each experience is in, in, independent and uninterrupted. So you're not blocked on any front, but the phone is powering this whole thing. Uh, now, while I have this open side by side, I want to show you something kind of cool. I talked about the power of these universal apps, how they can scale to screen sizes. Watch this. Right here on my monitor, the phone is pushing the Outlook Universal app, right? Watch this. I'm going to open it on the phone, and you're actually going to see it collapse and scale down to the phone. That's the power of a, of a universal app in action. This app does not care what screen size it is. It just adapts in real time and looks great. What do you think of that? Yeah. But now, i got to do some stuff in PowerPoint. So let me, let me get into the nitty-gritty and actually show you this. Um, I'm going to jump over to Word because I have to put a table in the middle of this deck. That's what the mail said. So look at this. Here's Word. I want to put this table there. Guess what? I can select it, and even though my phone is powering this, I can use all the keyboard shortcuts I'm familiar with. So actually, on my keyboard now, we're going to cut to a camera where you can see my hand. Make sure that that comes up there. I actually am going to do old control uh, C, and guess how I'll switch? How about I try a little bit of Alt-Tab just to jump over to PowerPoint? Alt-Tab on my phone to switch between Office apps, that's insane, and I'll just go ahead and do control V to paste that table. I am not feeling the purple, I, even though I'm wearing it, so maybe I'm a little bit of a hypocrite. I'm going to jump to the little slate there and get the rich formatting of the table the way that I want it, easy to move it into place. Okay, is that insane? The phone is doing this.